hey kids, let's talk about how you are going to access your social studies content through your iPad and TCI. We are going to actually open up Safari for this. And when you get into Safari, you are going to go to student.teachtci.com. And then when you get to a page that looks like this, you are going to click sign in with Google. And you're going to enter your school issued email address. Now you might have your email address pop up already for you if you've logged into something else, Google. And if you have, you'll just select that in advance. Press next. Okay, it will ask you to log into your Microsoft account again. So you'll have to enter your email address again, or you could copy and paste from notes. And then you're gonna put in your password with the FT on the end, or it may be a longer, um, pass phrase that includes a, includes a couple of words, depending on um, if you are a new student. Then you're going to enter your password and um, it would be your school issued password with either the FT on it or it would be a pass phrase. And then you press sign in and you can go ahead and reduce the number of times if you want and check that box. And once you are into um, TCI, we're going to go ahead and probably create a new account unless you were in TCI last year. So uh, we are going to create a new TCI account and now you have to um, add your teacher's email or username. Your teacher has to give you this information. Okay, once you have entered your teacher's information, you're going to press go. Once you've entered your teacher's email address or username, you will need to select the course that you are in from the drop down menu. You'll just select that course and press choose class and it should allow you into the course. From here, you can check out the program content. You can um, navigate using the sidebar to things like the text, uh, possibly the notebook if you want to look at that. If we go back into the text, you can navigate through different ways by selecting different lessons from the drop down lesson box or you can select different sections of the lesson by um, using the drop down box. The platform also has some built in tools that you might find helpful, including things like a highlighting tool. To highlight, you'll tap on the highlighter and then use your finger to select text and press the highlighting color. You can also save your highlighted text to your Google Drive and you can um, even use a little notes area where you can type in the box. Anything else that you need to do in this platform, your teacher will give you directions on and tell you where to go.